rest stop. We're at McDonald's. Uh, we just stopped really quickly. We've only been on the road for about two hours. Two hours. Um, we were in what, Albany, Wyoming. <laughs> yeah. I don't know what this town's called, but the where we got pulled over was said Albany. Um, we got pulled over by a state trooper. State trooper? We got pulled over by a state trooper. The ticket wasn't that bad. Not as expensive as Colorado. But Alex was speeding on a road that had no cars on it. Like, no cars for miles. We hadn't seen, like, a single car in probably over an hour. So, but he was speeding, and he got pulled over, and he got a ticket. <laughs> so, we're stopping right now. Alex can tell you more, more about that later. We've got about five hours more to drive. And then we'll probably stop at around 9 or 10. So in about three hours. You say hi. Are you ready to go to Utah? Utah? Alright, I decided I'm going to do a sick rap road tripping song. But we only have like one or two instrumental beats and this is the one that came on. So let's do this. Alright, here we go. The fam is going to Utah and I am here to be loud but not to make a brew hot and I am driving in the Honda with my wife and my kids please forgive me if you think that I have gone and lost my lip I'm talking about going everybody in trucks parking tickets cost me bucks speeding tickets cost me bucks yeah I'm saying there's wind in Wyoming Ming. yeah I cannot sing sing and I didn't bring my bling bling Charlotte's probably sleep, gonna get some Z's. I am needing some sleep as well for me. Right. It'll be interesting to go to, um, what do you call the middle of June? Charlotte? on Northwest East Street. And every time I say something, it changes directions. Uh, weren't we just at the mall? And there's like no stores at the mall, but there's, there's, a, there's a Google store and we can't even use Google Maps. My In-N-Out Burger is gonna be cold and poopy burger. Ooh, microwave. Oh, we do. That's that's my first In and Out burger is going to be a, a twice reheated, soggy <laughs> lettuce having just the nastiest In and Out burger with to go with my nasty In and Out Coke. <laughs> it could have just been my high expectations that led me to this crashing down moment. Okay, wait, I want you to listen to this. It said, in a quarter mile, turn left on Admiral Bird Road. I was just on Admiral Bird Road. Is this Admiral Bird Road? Mm-hmm. No, it's not, Audrey, you're throwing me off. 
<laughs> it's really nice fan. Oh my gosh, Claudine is just, like busy now. Oh, I told you. You were joking like, yeah, you're totally going to need a reservation on Mother's Day weekend in Salt Lake City. Well, guess what? What? I did. Mm -hmm. All right, this is day two of our trip to Utah. And we got up. Sorry, she's bus busting a little bit. We're about to leave. Um, we woke up, we had breakfast. We woke up, we had breakfast. And now we are about to um, head out. We are going to drive through a few neighborhoods. We're going to drive through West Jordan. I'm pretty sure it's called. And a couple other ones and just see, just drive around the neighborhoods and see if we like it. I don't know anything about um, the surrounding neighborhoods of Salt Lake City. I've been doing some research, but you just, you never know. I mean, if you look it up online, if you look it up online, they say that like Aurora is one of the up and coming cities of Denver and I really don't like Aurora. Like I really don't like it. That's my personal opinion. So um, I think that you have to take some of the, obviously look at the school scores and you know, crime and things like that, but you can't take it on and vlogging. Say hi Carson. Where's Carson? Hi Carson. Oh, thanks. You okay? Oh. But you have to kind of take people's reviews with a grain of salt. And um, so we are going to drive around a couple of the neighborhoods. Hi, you want to say hi? Hi. <laughs> <coughs> and see what we can find that we like. Hi, hi. guys well we're back in Colorado um, you know we got back a few hours ago and have had some time to get settled and get the dog and get the kids to bed but I just wanted to kind of check in and and go over how our vacation wound up it was um, it was okay we ate there then we met a couple very nice people and we went over to look at homes um, some of the homes we found were very nice um, they're on a hillside so it was a pretty steep grade actually and I don't know if I really want to be or want Audrey to be driving up something like that in the snow and um, it's, there's a college right in the middle of the neighborhood so I you know I, I don't know we we were kind of disappointed to be honest with you um, and you know that's okay it's 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 under it's why we came here you know we came here to see what was happening and you know we saw a house online that we thought would be, oh, that would be really nice. And we, we looked at the surrounding neighborhood and yes, it was adjacent to a very nice school, but those houses had kind of small backyards and even though the house was very nice, it wasn't necessarily in a nice place for it. Um, after that, we went to Salt Lake. I had my first In-N-Out burger. I think Audrey caught a clip of that, um, but it was very good. I'm, I was super happy. That's a bucket list item for me. And um, you know, to anybody out there, it's it's awesome. I there's three three items on the menu. They're all burgers. Audrey's milkshake was outstanding, and um, the fries were pretty good too. So I'm not a food critic, but I would definitely say for the money, it was uh, it was not a bad investment. Um, after that, we went to West Jordan this morning. We kind of you know the the neighborhoods were just not 
really what we were looking for. So even though the scenery was beautiful and it, Utah is truly a beautiful state, um, you know, it, it was, I don't know. It, I guess it just wasn't for us. So um, that's not to shut the door on it completely, but we definitely are looking forward to our trip to Charlotte coming up here in June. Um, that's going to be really exciting to, to go see that area. Um, you know, we've lived here all our lives, and, and I definitely have, so I don't know what the future brings for that. Um, obviously, I think that as that trip from Utah, um, you know, showed that Utah wasn't really somewhere that fit us right now, um, I think that made the case stronger to stay here as well as, as look into Charlotte. Um, and I'm not I'm not closed minded to, to, to getting out of Denver you know that's not my adjective or excuse my adjective um, that's not my you know prerogative with this whole thing um, and you know we'll see we'll see where it goes but uh, the kids were very good our daughter's sick we came home and she does not feel well um, that stinks, but our my father-in-law brought us Chipotle. That was awesome. Uh, brought Audrey a Mother's Day card. Audrey got a lot of gifts and she got some cookies. Uh, my mom makes the best peanut butter cookies and I'm so excited to, um, you know, maybe pinch a few of them from her or, you know, you know what I mean. So, anyways, um, I'm going to wrap it up, uh, but I will talk to you guys later and... You guys have a good night. Thanks.